Hey guys, welcome back to Vanguard Motor Sales. I'm Greg, and this is one drop dead gorgeous 1968 Mustang Fastback. This baby's been on the rotisserie, and it's got a 557 cubic inch motor in it with Kazi heads on top. Yeah, that's right, Boss 9 heads. Look at this beautiful black car with those Wimpleton white stripes. It's got the uh, Shelby GT grill in it with the driving lights. This thing is completely customized, resto modded out. It is one of the coolest Mustangs I've ever seen, man. Six speed transmission. She is looking absolutely gorgeous. The black paint on it is slick as can be. They've blacked out the bumper. They've brought the stripes right down to the chin spoiler. I mean, everything about this car is just absolutely gorgeous. Of course, we got the hood pins on here. Got to keep that hood down, all that horsepower under that hood. As you look down the side of it, man, it is just as straight as can be. Everybody that knows paint knows you gotta be a good body man to spray black paint. And the guy that did this one did a slick job. Wait till you see the bottom of this car. It's absolutely gorgeous. She is just as smooth as can be. Great looking set of GT40 style wheels. Those are real American racing Shelby wheels also. And then check out the interior, man. Look at that door panel. Now the texture you see in here, that actually comes from the factory. Henry Ford put that in there, or Henry Ford Jr. or one of them Henry Fords. It's got a tilt column in it. You see the center console, all customized looking sweet. We got great looking bucket seats in there. We got the roll bar with the shoulder belts. It does have a back seat in it, so you can put the kitties back there, take them for a ride, get to the ice cream store, get to the, uh, car show. I mean, take this thing anywhere and have a blast. One of the coolest things is they pretty much left the dash alone. It's got some resto mod gauges in the stock locations. We've got some great looking chrome there, great looking pedals. I mean, look at the door jam too, man. Look how slick that is. Anybody that spends that much time um, slicking down a door jam, you know they did a beautiful job on the rest of the car too. Everything's lining up nice back here. It's got the Shelby tail lights, the Shelby fuel fill. They've blacked out the bumper out back here also. I mean, she's just looking beautiful. We'll get inside the trunk here real quick. We got stereo in the trunk. We got a nicely finished trunk there. Not a whole lot of room for anything. If you're gonna go golfing or whatever, you better leave your wife at home. Just put them golf clubs in the front seat. That's what I'd do. Look down the side of this thing, man. You want to talk about slick? The stance on it's killer also. And get a load of all the reflections in that beautiful black paint. Looks like a big black mirror was draped over this beauty. And of course, right here, that's where that 557 is going to do its talking. Everybody's going to hear you coming. Now at Vanguard Motor Sales, we own every one of our cars in inventory. And a lot of you may be wondering what that means to you. Kazi power, baby. Let's go. Sounding amazing, man. I tell you what, Mr. Kazi can put together a motor. It's amazing. Love this car. She's black. She's got stripes. She's done on the bottom side. And Kazi power, baby. Tell you what, I got a set of Kazi heads, but they're not Boss 9 heads. This is Boss 9 with extra cubic inches, baby. 
We can ship it anywhere in the world too. You just give us a call at 248-974-9513. Tom will tell you just how easy it is to park this dream in your driveway. Trans feels good shifting up and down. Brake feels good. Power steering feels great. And then look down here on the dash. What's so cool is they've left basically the stock dash, but those are aftermarket gauges. Then we got the brand new tilt steering column, the custom wheel, the custom shifter here. It's got an aftermarket stereo in it. And I love that big old hood scoop out there. That hood scoop is covering up that gigantic Kazi power plant. I want to thank all of you who have subscribed to our channel. We've got new inventory coming in every day. Check it often. And if you want to get a notification every time we get something new in, subscribe to our channel and hit that little bell button. And we'll send you a notification every time we get something new in. And thank you so much for subscribing. We're right outside the Motor City. If you want to come visit, we'd love to have you. We're right here at the shop right now. We're located right here in the Motor City at 15100 Keel Street in Plymouth, Michigan. This building is where our team of 15 world-class mechanics inspect and improve every one of our cars. All of our work is done in-house. Our mechanics only service the vehicles we sell. We start with a thorough inspection and test drive. Then our team gets to work. We take the time to learn each car and fix the things that I would fix if it was mine. If that means the engine needs to come out, then it comes out. When you purchase a classic car from an auction or another dealer, in most cases it hasn't been inspected or serviced. You may be in for some unpleasant surprises. At Vanguard, we save you from the headaches that cost you time and money by handling this process for you. Right down the road is our 40,000 square foot indoor showroom. This building is climate controlled and houses over 100 amazing vehicles. We're constantly bringing in new inventory so you never know what might show up tomorrow. We are underneath this beautiful Mustang now. And as you can see, it's got a brand new gas tank in it, uh, fuel pump mounted down here to the frame where you don't have to listen to it. Uh, we do have a four bar set up here holding that Ford nine inch in there. And there's right around the 350 gear, and of course it is posy. You can see the coilovers all polished up, looking good, and hold up the back end. We got the Willwood disc brakes out back. It looks like the parking brake is hooked up. Everything under here nice and pretty. Uh, fuel lines all polished up, headed up front, all brand new, of course. Brake lines are all brand new. Parking brake cables tucked up into the uh, into the hoop here. We got a brand new drive shaft. We got a great looking exhaust. They got it tucked all the way up in here. We got frame ties here. We got a crossover. We got the Tremec six speed transmission here. Everything under here is finished off, looking slick as can be. Then of course we got our big 557 up front here. We'll talk about that in a little bit. We got explosion proof bell housing. We got an aftermarket front cross member and suspension. It's a Mustang two style. We've got a big sway bar up here. We got power rack and pinion steering. All the frame has all been smoothed out, painted up, looking brand new. Of course, we got Willwood disc brakes up front also. We got a big aluminum radiator there. They got a nice chin spoiler and they've also made a brace for the backside of sp chin spoiler, which is super cool. Tell you what, the wheel wells are all nice and uh, clean. They've actually uh, built a couple, uh, um, I, for the lack of a better term, tunnel for, I believe that's the, uh, the uh, AC lines going up in there, but they're all hidden in there in their own little compartment. We've got these great looking American Racing Shelby wheels. These are the GT40 style. Now these have a little set screw in them. So when you want to take those lug nuts off, you take that set screw loose and spin that spinner off. And we have, let's see, where's the size? 225, 45, 17s up front. And when you look down the side of this thing, it is a black beauty. Uh, she is a recreation of a GT500 or it, it's somebody's recreation of GT500. Obviously they didn't want make one 
with boss heads on it. And look at the bottom side of this rocker. Look how they shaped everything, how they painted everything, and just looking beautiful. And right here where the music from that 557 comes out, right there. Now out back, again, same good looking Shelby wheel. And then we have two 55, 45, 17s on the back. Well, we're gonna get under the hood right now and show you what's making the horsepower. All right, look at this shiny beast. We got Kazi heads. These Boss 9 heads are looking amazing. Uh, valve covers all polished up. The aluminum intake all polished up. We got a big four barrel sitting on top. That custom air cleaner really looking sweet also. We got a polished up master cylinder there. I mean, everything that can be polished, anything that's aluminum is all polished up. Anything that can be chromed has been chromed. We got a uh, aftermarket flamethrower. Um, um, distributor there, the coils mounted down here, uh, it does have power steering, I talked about that earlier, the alternators polished up, the water pumps polished up, everything. Even the AC compressors polished up, it's buried down there in the bottom. Uh, we got MSD uh, power here, we have an MSD um, retard box here, so when you fire this baby up, it uh, retards the timing. We got uh, polished up uh, radiator here. You can see the uh, AC um, condenser here, all looking brand new. We got an extra fan on there. I mean, everything under here, I mean, it is looking brand new under here. And right down in here is where I was telling you about, it's got that little um, trough there hiding the hoses. You see where they go through the inner fender right there. Uh, that aftermarket front suspension, uh, like I said, it's a Mustang II style front suspension. Great big old headers on those big Kazi heads. I mean, 557 cubic inches. We're estimating at around 740 uh, horsepower is what it's capable of. She's just an amazing beast. So give us a call at 248-974-9513 and let Vanguard Motor Sales park this dream in your driveway.